So I thought I'd let you see the sunset. The sunset. Or sun, sunrise. Lord Vicky. Sunrise. <laughs> I'm already done. Well, then I'm going the wrong way if I'm done. <laughs> so this little restaurant over here on the right, I don't know if you saw it. Shorty, short stops. I think it's supposed to open today. And then I saw we were getting another one similar to it called Highway 155. I guess they think we need uh, more hamburger and milkshake joints. Being that we already got Sonic and Cookout and Cookout stays packed. So anyway, I guess they felt we needed some more. <laughs> I wish we could get it just a decent, and I mean, it's not that we don't have one, but I, I would just like another option of a steakhouse. That's it. Just another option of a steakhouse. I thought we were getting one, but it doesn't look like it. But anyway, there is a room where we are, but we'll see. Anyway, happy Tuesday. I'm going to work, and this is December 27th. You know, I used to put the dates in these vlogs and I quit, but I'm doing it today. I'll turn you around in a minute. Oh, well, let's just go ahead and do it. All right, here we are. Here we are. I feel like that I've turned into a marshmallow or the marshmallow man or whatever, because I feel so swollen. It is because I ate sausage balls. I ate those I guess I felt like I needed to eat them because if not, they were going to go in the trash and uh, they're just too good to go in the trash. <laughs> this is the only time of year I make them and I'm going to eat them. So I'll just pay the consequences for it. It's my own fault. Whatever. So yesterday I made the note that I was... Do we want to go? Yeah, we can go down here and park. I said that I was going to... I was watching videos to try to scare me into eating right. And I, I know those videos are just a waste of time because I'll sit there and I'll find a way because, you know, I talk back to the screen. I just know that anybody, anybody I am watching, don't care who it is, I'm talking back to you. Sometimes it's nice and sometimes it's not. <laughs> so just letting you know. But now I will say most of the time it's nice, but every once in a while, some people I watch... I know it's not anybody that watches me that does videos, but sometimes with other people, I'll say something smart, smart alecky. It's just my nature. I'd, t I'd say it to you if if you were uh, sitting here beside of me. That's the way I look at it. Cause I tell you that, no, no, no. <laughs> anyway, I guess that's why I don't have many friends is cause I tell it like it is. I tell it like it is, and some people can't handle that. Anyway, what am I going to do? What am I doing here? Okay, I got all my, I was going to talk about my reindeer earrings. I'm still wearing my, I will wear my holiday attire until Epiphany, January 6th. I'll quit wearing it January 7th. Anyway, these earrings, I probably gave $2.99 for them at Walmart years ago. I know that Marsha has some. I've had mine for years. It's one of the few pairs of holiday earrings I can keep up with. I do not know why, but I do. I keep up with them. And maybe it's because, for whatever reason, they do not irritate my ears. I don't know why, but they don't. I might be wearing them year-round. No, I'm not. I did order some. And I don't even tell you what they are at this point. I'll have to link them below. Uh, some earrings that Sylvia told me to order. And I've worn them two times. And the only thing I noticed was just a little bit of scaling back here. But nothing like I have on some of them. And you know, that could be weather or whatever. So I don't know. So far, so good with those. But I'll link them below. They're from Walmart. They're cheap. I just don't buy anything expensive because, as I've said before, I could buy 14 karat gold and for whatever reason, they would still irritate my ears. So, 
There's a few that don't. I, QVC, I can order expensive earrings from that are 14 karat gold and they won't bother me. But I end up losing them, so that's another reason why I don't order them. So that's about it. I think I'm going to have to get to work. Uh, makeup today, a little bit different than what I, uh, well, I, I wore it Saturday when I did the Christmas Eve vlog. Uh, the Absolute Foundation. Now, the colors are really iffy right now. I look to see, and so usually there's more than one color available. Right now, there's not but one on the websites I have looked. So I don't know. They may be reformulating. They may be phasing it out. It's been on the market forever. It's like the Renergy. Both of those have been on the market forever. And I know they have a, you know, an audience that, or a buyer that buys that, that's the only thing they buy. So I can't see them discontinuing it. Maybe it's just, they've sold out. I don't know. Since, you know, they have the 20% off sales and all that stuff. So maybe it's just they're sold out. You know, they don't sell them, sell the Absolute line at Sephora. Um, it's only at either their website or department stores. So check with, you know, I did look at Dillard's. I did not look at Nordstrom or any of those, so they might have it. But I still say it's it's a good one for the winter time, especially when it's extremely cold, even if you have oily skin. Because right now my skin is not oily. It's not dry but it's not oily, so I guess it's normal. <laughs> and it works for me right now. Now, if I wore a really glowy primer, it wouldn't work. But what I've been using, of course, is the Jane Ardell uh, Liquid Minerals as a primer. And then I just lightly, I mean lightly, one little dot here, one little dot here, here, and here, and here. And then I use my Stands Out sponge. And I know I said I was gonna do a get ready with me, but you know, I need to just shut up and just surprise you. And that's it. I'm not wearing any powder. I wore, I applied the Charlotte Tilbury Bronze and Glow, or Film Star Bronze and Glow. And that's all the powder I used. I didn't use any on my nose today. May regret that, but I've got some at work if I need to. Anyway, we did have a pipe to burst, but luckily nothing got in the house. It was all outside, so I uh, had to get somebody to come and fix it yesterday. So that was kind of a, I guess, stress. It's more stress trying to keep my mom calm down than it is anything. Uh, you know, we were lucky. We got a plumber. He was out with, it. When, with us calling him. He was there in two hours, which shocked me. I was so afraid we weren't going to have any water because I could... I got it turned off, and so I could turn it on when we needed to go to the bathroom and when uh, I took a shower, but that was about it. So I didn't want to have to do that all night. I didn't want to have to get up and go turn the water on and go to the bathroom. <laughs> but if I had to have had, I would, I mean, it's just the way it would have been. But anyway, we got it fixed for now. He just cut off that one line. It's to the back, it's backyard, like we used it, use it to water the lawn or wash the deck off. So we don't use it much. I don't use it to wash a car because I don't wash a car anymore. <laughs> if I wash the car now, it's in front, the front yard. So, and that one has a, you know, knock on wood, it won't. Because if that one does, then the water will have to be cut off. Anyway, hopefully it's warmed up enough. We don't have to worry about it. And I still don't mind cold weather at all. I don't want it to be zero because of stuff like that. And I don't want it to come in the way it did because we had so many people in the county here. Uh, I think we were the top county, or if not, we were the next to the top county with the most power outages because of the wind. Um, the wind was just horrible here. And, you know, the ground was saturated. And with the front coming through, it just started blowing trees down right and left. Power lines right and left. So we were lucky we, that never happened, but there was a lot of people that, you know, lost power, it stayed out for probably 36 hours or more. Their pipes did burst, flooded their house. Um, you know, it's just awful. So anyway, 
I don't want it that cold ever again. I just want it to be 15. 15 is enough. <laughs> I know y'all think I'm crazy. Anyway, I'm going to shut up. That's all I'm going to say today. And I will talk to y'all later. Love you. Bye.